Hi all. I wanted to talk with you about the Ten Commandments, mainly about about why is God a jealous God, like it says in the in the Ten Commandments. But I won't read read you out that whole commandment or what's on that passage. Basically, it's in it's in the New King James Version or any of the versions you want to read where it talks about where it talks about it, say, it says in Exodus it says in e Exodus 20 well basically start from Exodus, tw Exodus, Exodus 20 which is spelled E-X-O-D-U-S Exodus 20 it is the first part of Exodus 20, Exodus 20, verse 2. So basically, the reason why God is a jealous God is because, you know, he, you know, when when we when we when we're not in God, when we're not following God or following Jesus, following Christianity, basically, you know, you know. Although the Bible says also, you know, God will bless the righteous and the and the unrighteous, the the Christian and the non-Christian. You know, there's there's although it says that you you will only, you will bless both parties, but you know when we when we're Christians, spirit-filled and born again genuine Christians God can God can really bless us more when we when we're Christians when we're Christians and when we're not Christians God can't really bless us that much when we when God can't bless us that much when we're not a Christian it's not a case of God stopping it it's a case it's a case of the devil the devil stealing our salvation and not and not letting us and not letting us you know and blocking blocking access to blocking access to to the devil the devil blocks blocks access for our for our blessings to from God basically and you know how do I know that you know as 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 you know the devil the devil the devil the devil only does at least three things he lies he steals in this and he destroys that's what it says in the bible the, like the bible says you can look it up in the, in these words in these words and you can type on, type on the search engine where it says in the bible the devil only comes to steal kill and destroy and it, and it could be from anything that you that you've had in the past or present or future he's come to steal to kill it and, and to destroy it and you know any and as we know the devil roars about a like a lion seeking who whom he may devour like it says in the Bible as well. You can check that out you can write that out. Check that out on the search engines. So you know like I said it's not a case of you know God blocking the blessing. It's a case of you know God God's hand can't be upon your life because one 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 guy, one preacher said, actually, you know, you know, the devil know, knows who's sealed with, 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 with who, the devil knows who's, who's sealed with, who's sealed with the righteous and good, goodness and the, and the, and, and the, the joy, the joy and the joy and the enjoyment of God, you know, or that's that's belonging to Christians, the joy and happiness of life, the. Basically, Christians are, are are sealed with that seal of blessing and happiness, and and the devil knows it. And when the devil knows that, when the devil knows that we're, we're, we're us Christians are sealed, and the devil can see that, you know, the devil the devil can't really touch us at all, or or touch any Christians, any any true true genuine Christians, or any kind of Christians that are Christians that declare themselves Christians. Or declare themselves uh, that they want to try and follow God properly, or 
or they or if they're doing their best to follow God then God God will seal seal them even if they they make mistakes and they don't and, and they don't understand their mistakes Christians you know God still seals them and even if they're trying to cheat God you know or steal or something on purpose you know God will give God will still I believe that God will still still seal seal them God will still seal them you know even if they're doing a crime and and but it depends on, on what they what their motive is as well depending on depending if they do the crime and they they're gonna plan on doing regular crimes every year all the time then they obviously won't have that seal but if they're doing it by mistake or something like that or doing it as a one-off you know God will obviously forgive them but you know but if we're constantly expecting God to forgive us all the time then eventually there is a possibility that God will just leave you to the devil and and God will remove his hand ha God will remove his hand of protection up upon your life God will God will remove his hand of protection so yeah so yeah that that's really all I have to say for this video so any anything you want to ask me give me a call and that's it for now god bless take care peace be with you bye for now